Shalom family. So there's a new birth gap film and it shows the explosion in childlessness driving population collapse, not decline, collapse across the world. It's a situation unprecedented in human history. Most of the world's people live in a country that has dipped below replacement rate. Population is now spiraling downward and there is no way to combat it. No place on earth is exempt from the declining birth rates, including Africa, which is a few steps behind the rest of the world. The scenario, without exaggeration, is apocalyptic. Love it when they use words like this. No society in history has been known to come out of that spiral, filmmaker Stephen Shaw explains in the documentary Birth Gap, which explores the thoughts on childbearing of young women around the world and attempts to find the cause behind today's record low fertility. Interesting. I wonder if it has anything to do with snake bite, but we won't go there just yet. It's definitely an, an organized, orchestrated program to do exactly what we're seeing now around the world as everything collapses. And there is that limit, if you didn't know about that, where when a population reaches that point and goes below it, there is no recovery, no matter what they do. And most are below that limit or heading to that limit really fast. And isn't it interesting that here at the end, where we've surpassed 8 billion and increasing the waters have risen and there are many waters just before we're called out of those waters those waters now start declining now if you read the book of revelation you'll note one thing at the end of human history there is a constant decline of those waters those waters being the nations and the peoples it keeps going down Disaster after disaster, after war, after plague, after trumpet, after judgment, it keeps going down, 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 all the way to the final battle. We're at that point now. We're seeing that. The next big decrease is going to be the rapture any minute. And from there on in, just down. God bless. Be excited. Keep watching for that blessed hope. Be excited that you got to live at a time such as this and see things that the prophets spoke about that they wish they could have seen, believe it or not. Shalom.